The first group of Afghan refugees has arrived here in the valley. Many organizations are now pitching in to help people get back on their feet. Danielle Miller is live tonight with the story. Danielle. Governor Doug Ducey thanking the refugee resettlement agencies helping with the Afghan refugees recently brought here to Arizona. Ducey saying in a tweet, the refugees were brought to Arizona on Sunday night. No word on where or how long they'll stay, but Sammy Jones Merrill knew they need supplies, so she decided to host a donation drive. They're coming with nothing, just most of them are coming with the clothes on their back or a backpack full of stuff. Sammy is collecting all sorts of items, especially things for immediate needs. Laundry detergent, diapers, um, soaps, uh, some sh some sizes of shoes that they sound like they're low on. Once her donation drive is complete on Friday, she'll pack up her truck and take the items to two local organizations helping out. Both of them are in Tempe. One of them's called Welcome to America Project, and they're the ones that are getting um, all these uh, needs of like uh, the laundry detergent and stuff and then gathering humanity um, they're accepting some bigger donations and so I will be dropping off some furniture there um, and another thing that people are dropping off later today is bikes because bikes is just free transportation for these people. Sammy says although this may be just a small drop in the bucket she's happy she could help in some way. Something that I feel like a lot of people have been feeling helpless about like the situation in the last couple weeks and this is finally something um, that we can do. And I think a lot of people want to help. And Governor Doug Ducey did say that these Afghan refugees arrived here Sunday night. Now, in terms of that donation drive, Sammy is collecting things tomorrow as well, and then she'll be wrapping up. So still plenty of time if you would like to help. She has all the information on her social media pages. We have a link to those on our website, fox10phoenix.com. Reporting live, Danielle Miller, Fox 10 News.